You got to put some respect on this guy's name. So regardless of how hype we all about him and you just hate the fact that we are so hype about him and we talk so much about him, you just got to look at it and respect it. Because in your own personal life, you probably don't have that kind of discipline that he has and the kind of discipline that he's trying to get these young men to put in in order for them to achieve their goals. Because there are going to be things after football that's going to help them. The things that he's implementing after football, these things can help these young men. And he's so passionate about that that's why you gotta respect this guy that's why you gotta lay off the the silly names and the clown emojis you gotta lay off of that stuff because he's doing the right things he's more disciplined than you are he's more disciplined in a day than you could ever be in a lifetime you gotta put some respect on his name and i like what he's doing as a human being and as a coach the winning is gonna come and shut a lot of you guys up i'm looking at somebody who's probably gonna be the first african-american coach to win a natty i'm telling you man when you are disciplined at this level the only thing you need is time year two year three before you know it we're going to be celebrating a natty while a lot of you haters and detractors are going to be sitting back and licking your chops like damn i can't believe he won it let's keep going good place for your dream